welcome back my little subscribers this is yet another video this time we're talking about the watch world again so stick around to learn about the Ware Hadley brand so another passion of mine is watches and along with that comes the joy of switching watch straps all the time for different watches and in this example I've got the Marvin watch um, it has my name so that's one of the reasons I bought it but I also got it because it's a 1950s vintage uh, Seamaster styled watch and this is a Swiss company that's been around since 18 um, something let me see the years on here I forgot but it's been around for a while and so I love this watch and it's a strap monster is what we call a watch when you can just put any strap on it and it'll look great in this case I've got it on a blue strap um, from Hadley Roma which is the parent company of this new uh, brand called Wear Hadley uh, that brings out the top most popular easy everyday to use straps from Hadley Roma with a twist a, mo a more modern take on them so what I'm excited about is to show you the variety that this brand has to offer in terms of watch straps and if you're a fan of watch straps you're gonna love this because they have everything <laughs> you could want in terms of flexibility um, resist like everyday resistance and durability so let's we're gonna dive into each one of these three straps as a first impressions and then later on I'll make a video and you can see it on different watches uh, to suit different looks so again this brand is related to Hadley Roma and if you don't know much about this company it's actually been around for a long time since 1912 founded by Art Hadley and so these straps I mean when you buy a strap that has Hadley's name you're going to get a high quality product and that's been my experience with a couple that I've gotten um, so I'm excited because this this Wear Hadley um, brand from them uh, really is trying to be innovative and focuses on sustainability, uh, making straps from animal free materials. You know, of course, you they have their standard leather, and uh, I think it's called alligator. So you can still get those, but they're moving forward to the very modern approach which is good for all of us being sustainable making straps out of materials that are unique so we've got straps like microfiber which is very comfortable I've heard um, they've got the hybrid straps which I'll show you but my favorite one so far is the apple skin uh, strap and that's <laughs> it's basically what I just said it's a strap made out of the fibers of apple skin and that means it's breathable it's comfortable you can get it in different colors they go with everything and they look like leather straps uh, but they feel just as comfortable just as luxurious for your nice fancy watch um, I'm gonna show you let's just get into it so I'm gonna move this to the side don't want to drop it oh it's lighting it's on the loose so let's see I, I don't remember what order they're in but it comes in nice box packaging has their brand on there all good stuff I think yeah they're all the same has the year they were founded 1912 like I said so here we go this one here this one here is the alligator green hybrid and I got it on a black buckle so that it goes with both uh, gold toned and steel watches I mean it's not exactly a match but I felt like this was better than choosing gold or steel um, it's just a more neutral color in terms of the buckle but that I mean that's debatable depends on your preference so the cool thing is we've got the alligator green here we've got the alligator green great brown color this one comes in brown and black the cool thing here is we've got quick release springs on all straps which just save you time you don't need the tools and sometimes you scratch your watch with the tools so this is actually 
very useful. I'm happy that they included that in all their straps. So hybrid is because we've got a portion that's leather green, and then we've got a rubber back to make it more sweat resistant, moisture, just in general, if you wet it or you're sweating, everyday use. This is what a lot of leather straps are missing today. Um, if you have leather straps, you know uh, within a couple months or over time, they smell like sweat. And they don't just smell like sweat, they're gonna, they, they're gonna feel like that too. And just makes it just more comfortable to have this hybrid. And as you can see, it's very flexible. I really like this. Again, it's a hybrid. And keep in mind, other brands are doing this. I think Omega, Omega, <laughs> Omega has a strap like this on their Constellation series, which is leather on top with the rubber on the back, just to make it fancy. But at the same time, we've got that sport feature. So really nice. Can't wait to try this one on. This is an easy combination on this watch. On this one, very easy with the brown. It actually came with a brown strap, but this one's a lot nicer than the one it came with. Easy match. I'm definitely going to try it on this one. All right, so let's put that one away. Show you the next one. Let's see what we got here. Oh, this is a nice color. This is a bison leather strap and it feels solid because this is just leather, not a hybrid. And this is on their green toned leather. I love green on watches and it, this type of green especially is very serious, fancy. It can go with a lot of colors. It can go with this watch, which I will, I mean, I'm gonna probably try all these straps on the same watch, um, but I've got others that have more colors, black dials. This will still make that uh, that type of watch stand out a lot. And this feels very solid. Uh, this is what I look for when I have a solid leather strap. Uh, the thickness, there's cushion, flexible, Got it on the black buckle, looks really clean. Easy spring bars, that is just a must. Everyone should be doing this. This strap feels premium, I love this strap. And I've been really into green lately, so I'm excited to use this one. Finally, and I think this is the highlight here, in terms of uh, innovative uh, feature, this is the Apple fiber, apple skin fiber leather. And I got it in red because when you think of an apple, you think a red apple. Um, it feels like a hybrid. It feels kind of like the alligator hybrid strap where on top you have that very leathery texture. Very beautiful stitching. It looks very good. You got that leather texture. I like that they didn't go with the traditional just drill a hole. It's, it's a shape instead of just the hole for the strap sizing. So that's unique. Um, this part here feels, it's not rubber, at least I don't think it is, but it feels smooth and it feels like when you sweat and when you're running around with this every day, uh, you won't damage it over time. And I don't think it would smell. So over time, I mean, I'll let you know, but I doubt it's going to do um, that sweat kind of like regular leather does. So it's cool to feel that smoothness. And it, I mean, this is going to feel good on the skin. I love this red tone. It's not too bright and shiny, it's matte. And the shine is actually coming from the stitching, which is really cool. And the back has a gold styled stitching. Very nice, I, I really like this. If you saw this uh, lying around, you wouldn't think it's made out of apple skin. I'm happy they're going for sustainability uh, and still bringing something that everyone uses, you know. All these leather straps that we use, we could have them in different colors because they invented this now. And so, just feels good, you know. Variety of products, very innovative. And this one, oh my God. This one's gonna look great 
gold and red, very fancy. But any watch with a black dial, um, a, a dark burgundy, this strap is going to make that watch pop. Like, I really like this blue, too. And this is from their, from Hadley Roma as well. Feels, this is exactly what I expected the quality to be. This one has a good cushion, too. So, yeah, that, this is great, great products, very innovative. The very cool thing is every strap, you can buy it at a traditional um, quick release or with the Apple Watch attachment to fit your Apple Watch. So any of these straps, you can get it with an Apple Watch attachment. You won't have to deal with figuring out how to find that nice fancy leather for your Apple Watch if that's what you're into. And you can still enjoy a very high quality product. So that's my first impressions on this. Um, as a photographer, my urge now is to put it on different watches and take pictures of them and show you uh, with high quality images how good these look. But over time, uh, I'm happy to give another video for you all to see um, how it looks on video, different watches. And so thanks for joining me. I hope you enjoyed this. For those of you that are strap addicts and watch addicts, this is exactly what we want. And this is our dream come true. So check it out. Hadley Roma, tons of options. You will not regret it. So far, I'm very impressed and I'm just excited to feel it on a watch. So that'll be the next video. Thanks. Really quick, um, I'm likely gonna try it on this new Gekoda. <laughs> I don't know really how to pronounce it. It's a British English brand that makes vintage watch reissues, sort of. Um, or vintage inspired watches. This one's from the 1950s. It's very reminiscent of a uh, Panerai, Radiomir, uh, but in a conservative, conservative 39 millimeter, which a lot of companies are missing the mark. I feel like too many are making huge watches, which is great, but they should be always a traditional size and this one hits it. Um, and I got this one because I loved that night sky star dial. And so, You'll see this one with these straps very soon. I, all the straps I just showed you, they will look great on this one. So stay tuned.